earth so significant in our lives. But from this particular vantage point, it's just that tiny blue speck. Where dope stuff happens, intro. Hi, I'm William Haynes. And I'm Steve Zaragoza. This is SourceFed. This video is brought to you by Subaru because they like dope science stuff just like we do. That was a rhyme. So Earth, that tiny blue speck in the universe where dope stuff happens every day. Things that happen here never cease to surprise me. Like the fact that the carbon in our apple pies were made in the interiors of collapsing stars, according to Carl Sagan, whoever that is. Probably some nerd that tames the kitty. And to add on to that, did you know that a new study published this week in the Journal of Science discovered that between 10 to 30% of Earth's water is actually older than the sun? Wow. In my Guys, even though it's probably not scientifically true, the sun is like the father of the universe. He's our daddy. Finding out the stuff that we have here on Earth might be older than the sun makes us like the sun's favorite child, am I right? Mm -hmm. Like That's like him leaving us his record collection, right? Mm. Once again, I did not go to science school. But under this logic, wouldn't that also mean that every human body, which is made up of 60% water, excluding my ex-wife because 30% of hers is made from hellfire, is also made up from pre-sun juice? This new discovery sounds like the origin story of a new superhero. His body is fueled by the nectar of extraterrestrial liquid from a pre-sun era. He is Captain Pre-Sun Man. Capri Sun Man? Hell yeah. Apparently a high percentage of water found on Earth was created or reformed in the solar nebula. A cloud of hot material which eventually also led to the creation of the sun and our planets and our cozy little huge solar system. Learning, Learning science, science, cool, fun. fun. Praise logic! But in all seriousness, this is a cool new scientific discovery. It just proves that there's so much we don't know about our own universe and we live in it. Like, where do flamingos come from? I mean, why are they on one leg all the time? Hey, if you're here, you clearly like science stuff. Click the link in the description down below to see Patrick Norton do some cool science stuff with a new 2015 Subaru Legacy. Your I mom's a legacy. Thank you. She's, she's a kind woman. For you guys at home, what's something older than you thought? Let us know in the comments down below. I got a question about the universe. What is it? I bet I know it. Where's sand from? Well, sand is an amalgamation of many times, I don't freaking know.